Hello everybody, McGregor here. Hope everybody's doing well. I just have, um, I guess you could say this is going to be uh, a bit of a, an announcement slash news type of thing that we're going to do right now. <laughs> the game I'm uh, going to have uh, running in the background is uh, Seven Days to Die. I had another uh, uh, recording with, uh, with my buddy there, so... <laughs> Just how you guys aren't looking at a black screen or or my name or whatnot. At least at least it's something going to be a little bit more interesting. <laughs> so yeah, I wanted to talk to you guys. So um, what's happening is well, first thing, my uh, playthrough of Infested Planet is going to be currently on hold. Uh, reason being is because I suck. I spent uh, <laughs> about a week trying to pass one map, and I have not been able to pass it. Uh, I don't know if, uh, <laughs> if if I just suck really, really, really badly, or uh, if uh, the balance on the map is a bit off. It's those damn, damn clones. I can't, I can't kill them. They're they're just too strong. <laughs> so I hope. Um, I'm gonna keep trying to beat the uh, the map uh, or the mission. Um, it it there might be a fix coming out or whatnot. Uh, I'm still playing version one of the game, so maybe I'll wait till uh, uh, till version 1.01 comes out or whatnot. So so that game's gonna be currently put on hold. I'm gonna try once in a while to beat it but I've tried multiple ways to try to beat that map and I have not been able to do it and I haven't been able to find any uh, strategies to actually beat that one map so I'll, I'll keep trying once in a while but uh, yeah yeah it's been it, it, it's been kicking my butt <laughs> but in the meantime in the meantime um, it might not be up on uh, Monday uh, I'm not too sure when this video is going out. Um, I'm probably going to send it out as soon as I finish re rendering it and all that. But I'm hoping to have uh, FTL up, Faster Than Light up. Uh, there's a new version, the Advanced Edition, that's out. And I haven't tried the Advanced Edition. I have played FTL before, and I've been waiting for the update. So I'm hoping to have that up in, uh, in Infested Planet's place. So hopefully monday if not monday then wednesday so we might only get one video tomorrow but i'll try to have it out <laughs> um another point is um i'm thinking of having uh an episode similar to this uh maybe once a month kind of like uh maybe the first friday of every month kind of have like a, a feedback uh feedback friday fan friday or something like that um basically just just for me to inform you guys what i'm doing what i'm thinking of doing what i'm planning on doing just to get feedback from you guys if you guys you know want me to do what i say i'm doing or whatnot or tell me not to bother or you know just just uh just to tell you guys what's on my mind more or less so um yeah. <laughs> um, another thing is, I might start doing on my channel game reviews. Um, I've been getting some requests um, here and there uh, on some of my videos on some of the games. Um, people are asking me, hey, is this game actually worth buying? Uh, somebody asked me that on Seven Days to Die, and I believe Infested Planet, somebody mentioned that, and I'm not too sure. I think Pixel Piracy, somebody also mentioned that if these games are actually worth buying and whatnot. So I might do maybe some time, type of small reviews. Oh, yeah, and I was also contacted uh, by a developer. Uh, if I can uh, review his game. Um, so I sent him off an email saying I'll do it. I haven't heard back from him. So I I just want to... Uh, I just had some concerns uh, about doing it. Because uh, 
well, first thing, I'm not going <laughs> to, uh, I'm not going to, uh, how can, how can I put it? Just because he's asking me, uh, to review his game, there's no promises that it's going to be, uh, a positive review. <laughs> Let me put it that way. Um, I'm, I'm very honest, uh, with my critique of games. So, yeah, so I, I just wanted to make sure he was all okay with that. And I wanted to make sure that he had full permission of all the assets in his game and all that. So he's an indie developer. Uh, so I'm just waiting for him to give me the go-ahead. And hopefully that will be up this week. Um, I haven't started playing the game yet. So, But I think what I'm going to do is I do like uh, uh, the WTF style of uh i know he it's not technically a review it's a it's a first look um i might do something like that um, but maybe more review based maybe like a first look type of review uh i tend to like that sort of format uh, i'm not going to give any game score like i'm not going to rate it like one out of ten i don't think or anything like that uh, i think i'm going to give you what i think are the pros and cons of the game uh and then based on that you guys decide if you want to get it or not so uh i think that's what i'm going to do for the game reviews and it's not going to be a main uh focus uh of the channel um and I'm probably just going to do reviews of the games I'm going to LP anyways, or the games that I want to LP. So, so unless if you guys want me to do it, or if you guys really don't want me to do it, um, it it's going to be addition to uh, my Let's Play, so, so it, it won't take anything out of what I'm already doing. So, unless if it's a huge, huge, huge game. <laughs> uh, another... Uh, thing I want to talk to you guys about was Minecraft. I'm looking at starting another Minecraft series, but a modded Minecraft series. Um, I would like to do uh, Obsidian Gate um, maybe Mondays and Thursdays, bring it down to two episodes a week, and having a, a modded Minecraft series Tuesdays and Fridays. That, that's what I'm thinking anyways. Now, my question to you guys is, which modded Minecraft, or which mod do you want me to play? Like, or which, uh, which mod pack do you want me to play? I looked at the B-Team uh, pack, and I don't think it's really for me. Um, I'm not really too sure what I'm looking for in the mod pack. Um, I'm looking for something maybe to make the game a little bit more difficult. I'm looking for something to automate the process. Um, one of the mod packs I was thinking of was, uh, I think it's uh, FTB, was it Monster or something like that? I think, I, was, I think that's the one I was looking at. Um, I've looked at a couple of the Tech It mod packs, but I, I want to get feedback from you guys. I want to know what you guys, what you guys would like uh, to see me play. So... Um, if you guys really want me to see me play the B team mod pack, I'll, I'll give it a shot. Um, or if you guys have another idea or if you guys, uh, I don't know. Yeah. J just, just let me know what you think. <laughs> Next thing on the list here is, uh, I wanted to let you guys know which games I'm, how can I put it? The games that I want to LP, uh, but I don't have time to right now. Um, right now, my Thief Let's Play uh, is nearly, I'm assuming it's nearly over. I still haven't, I haven't beaten the game yet. And uh, technically, Infested Planet is uh, coming to a close. It looks like I have about, <laughs> once I beat this map, I have about uh, three more episodes left of it. So... I'm going to have to find a game to put in its place. Um, now, I do have a couple of game ideas, and I just, I'm just i just naming the games right now. Uh, I just want to let, just, just so I can get feedback from you guys on, maybe you guys 
would like me to let's play it or i don't know you hate all the games and you have another suggestion but uh so here's here are some of the games that i have already um that i might do a let's play of and, and yeah just just give me feedback um so the first one is you guys might have seen it already is seven days to die uh, I might do a let's play of that. I might do, um, I was going to do a server one, but the problem is, is the game's not done yet, and there is some griefing and hacking still in the game, and I don't know any server admins right now, uh, so I don't know which it would be um, a reliable server to join. Let me put it that way. So I've thought of doing a little bit of a, a single player, quote, end quote, uh, seven days to die. I can run my own server, my own local server, um, and maybe do that and show you guys how to play the game and whatnot. Uh, the game is a little bit hard to get into, but once you get once you get going in the game, the game is actually really, really fun. So... I, I am actually interested in doing that. So another game I have is The Binding of Isaac. So we have that game. Uh, Castle Story, that's that's a pretty fun game. Uh, Danny Boy's actually playing that one. I have Chivalry Medieval Warfare. Um, I'm not really good at it. It's a fun game, but I'm not really good at it. Uh, let's see, I have Dungeon Defenders. That's an older one. Uh, I got Farming Simulator 2013. Uh, I mentioned Faster Than Light. I do have Gary's Mod. We could play a bit of Gary's Mod. Uh, let's see here. Oh, this one I've been wanting to play. Uh, the Kerbal Space Program. I've been really, really wanting to play this one. Um, and I think I... Well, I, I'm definitely going to have this one up on my channel. Uh, I'm going to do... Uh, a modded Kerbal Space Program. Now, the thing is, one of the mods I wanted to do is uh, it hasn't been updated to the newest version, and he's not updating the mod until version 0.24. So I might have to wait till version 0.24 to uh, uh, play Kerbal Space Program because I, I do want to do a modded series of it. Uh, let's see. I have Magicka. I have. Uh, we could do Orcs Must Die. Um, Paranautical Activity. That one's pretty fun, but also pretty hard. It's another game that's in uh, Alpha currently. Oh, uh, the next game on my list here that I think I will definitely play is Path of Exile. It's a free to play. Um. Hack and slash? What is it categorized? I'm not too sure. Uh, it's basically like Diablo, but it's a free-to-play game, and uh, it's pretty awesome. You get to build your own classes and all that, and your skills are are the gems in your item and your like weapons and armor, and oh, it's it's an awesome, awesome game, and and I love the way that they do their monetization. Uh, yeah. There's no pay to win uh, unless if they change it in the short amount of time that I've last viewed it. It's all uh, uh, cosmetics, so um, I can pay to have a different look for my spell and, and all that. So, so I think I am going to play that game. I actually did do a bit of recording, um, but uh, something happened during the recording, so I just scrapped it. Um, but I think I, I am going to play that game again. So, and, and that game is is really, really fun. And you, you guys might as well go check it out because, I mean, it is a free-to-play game. So, <laughs> so you, you, can't, you can't beat free-to-play. Uh, another game I have is Payday 2. That game is pretty fun. Uh, let's see. I'm just going down my Steam library list right now. Uh, Pixel Piracy, I'm playing that one right now, and that one is awesome i am loving pixel piracy so so much um i got rust um same with rust um it, it's basically the same thing with seven days to die i i need to find a, a stable server to play on um once i find a stable server then i'm more open to actually uh 
to do uh, episodes of it, or or if I do it also as a uh, with with somebody else, because on my own might be a bit boring. <laughs> At least for you guys to watch. I don't know. Um, another game uh, that I would like to put on my channel is Planet Side 2. Uh, but that one is a little bit harder for me to do. So, in terms of content, because I suck. <laughs> my reaction time's not that great. Uh, let's see. I have. We can do Sanctum and Sanctum 2. Um. I also got a game called Sans Froid, uh, Tales of Werewolves. It's basically a werewolf tower defense type of game, you could say. It kind of plays like uh, uh, Dungeon Defenders, but you play as French Canadians. <laughs> uh, Space Pirates and Zombies. I haven't played that game in a long time, uh, and, I, and I have thought about getting back into it. Uh, what other games? Well, you guys know about my uh, my old Starbound series. Um, I'll probably start by that back up um, once the game is a little bit more fleshed out. It is a very fun game, but it's a bit um, it's a bit stale once you hit end game. At least right now. So I, I'm waiting for that to. Uh, uh, to become more a little bit more complete um yeah the game is fun don't get me wrong but uh because i also play minecraft and putting star starbound on my channel also right now it'll just uh burn me out i guess you could say creatively <laughs> i'm not a great builder uh, let's see what else do we have here Starforge that's another good game um, it's a little bit lesser known than uh, than seven days to die even uh, and rust uh, it's um, how can I describe it I don't I, it's kind of hard to describe it's um, not really a survival game uh, you get to build uh, uh, bases and uh, go mining underground and you're on an alien planet you have to defend your base and whatnot it's, it's actually a very good looking game uh, it's still in early alpha though so it's a bit buggy right now so I'm waiting for it uh, Oh yeah, and then I know it also has uh, performance problems, at least right now. Um, at least while I'm recording, there's performance problems. So I have played around with that a bit. Uh, but I would like to put that on my channel once it's a little bit more fleshed out. Uh, Swords of the Stars, The Pit, I did a bit of that. Uh, I do, we could do uh, Team Fortress 2. I haven't played this game in a long time. I'm actually, uh, I was actually uh, a better participant on it. I got the little uh, uh, badge for that. <laughs> uh, let's see, we got Teleglitch. Uh, that's a, a, that's a, a roguelike, or you could say it's a roguelite. Um, I was going to put this up on my channel. But the way that the game moves, you guys might get sick. So, because <laughs> the map rotates like a lot, like it, it really, really rotates. So, so I decided not to put that up. But if you guys want me to put it up, I'll put it up. Uh, Terraria. Uh, oh, yeah. <laughs> uh, yeah. So we, I have Terraria. We could. Uh, I could put that on my channel. I didn't put it up on my channel before because I had Starbound up and those games are fairly, fairly similar, at least in terms of um, gameplay mechanics. So I got Towns. Uh, let's see here. I got War of, Vic War of the Vikings Early Access. We can play that game. Um, it's still, well, in, uh, I don't know if it's in beta right now or if it's alpha. Um, I would consider it in alpha right now because they're still adding content to it. 
Uh, so I am, I, I do have that game. I have played it a bit. It is actually really fun. Uh, it plays similar to uh, War of the Roses. Um, it's actually made by the same guys, I do believe. Um, and it, and if you know War of the Roses, War of the Roses plays a lot like Mountain Blade. <laughs> so, uh, so yeah. So if you like Mountain Blade multiplayer, you'll probably like War of the Roses or War of the Vikings. Oh, and another thing is, I I also have Mountain Blade. If you guys would like to see that. Uh, what else do I have here? Um, yeah, that those are the games. Those are the games I at least own right now. I also got Left 4 Dead. Uh, but those are the games I have right now that I actually wouldn't mind let's playing. Actually, all those that I listed. <laughs> um, there are even more games I would like to uh, put up on my channel. Well, of course. Um, but I, I just want to get feedback from you guys. So those are the games I I have right now. Um, but let me know if you would like me to play that any of one of those um i think well faster than light is uh the one that's definitely going to come up next on the channel and after that um kerbal space program is another definite that's going to come on the channel uh those two games <laughs> especially kerbal's oh, kerbal space program i've been playing that on my own i haven't been <laughs> recording it but uh oh man that that game is that game is so fun um i don't know maybe, maybe i'll just maybe i'll just find out what mods are there right now and uh but uh i i really the the mod that i want to play it's um ah uh, i forgot what it's called it's uh y you have to build a satellite network to uh so let's say if I send out a probe and whatnot, I send out a satellite, I have to have a satellite aimed at him so that I can actually control him. Um, that That's the mod that I that I want to install. <laughs> so, but I, I have a couple of ideas what we're gonna do with the uh, Ker Kerbal Space Program. So, so that, that one is definitely coming up on the channel. Uh, what else? I'm just talking away here. It's been uh, 22 minutes. Oh, man. <laughs> okay. Uh, last and not least is we are actually getting very, very close to 100 subscribers right now. And I want to thank all of you guys who have subscribed to me already. And uh, uh, and, to all the, and to all of you guys that haven't actually subscribed, subscribed did, 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 <laughs> to me yet um yeah it's it's just awesome uh having you guys actually watching joining me actually uh playing these games uh when i first started doing this uh i didn't expect really anybody to give me even a second glance so <laughs> so yeah you guys are awesome i wanted to thank you guys so much um but, uh, yeah, I'm a little bit lost for words, uh, which actually, yeah, yeah. <laughs> so I am, uh, going to be creating my, uh, uh, 100 subscriber special pretty soon. And if I really, honestly, though, if I had the time, I would actually do a subscriber special for each and every one of you guys. Um, but, <laughs> but yeah. Uh, so yeah, guys. Well, thanks for watching. Uh, basically, uh, well, too long. Didn't watch. Um, <laughs> I just want feedback from you guys. Um, what do you guys like? What do you think I can improve on? Um, the games that I listed to you guys. Do you like the idea of me let's playing one of them? Um, definitely Kerbal Space Program. I, I really want to do that game. I'm. Yeah, I'm. I'm like. Just even talking about it, I'm just I'm I'm ready to stop talking right now and just start jumping into it right now, honestly. Uh, but uh, so yeah, and once again, Infested Planet's being put on hold because I suck, uh, and uh, Faster Than Light's gonna be up in its place hopefully tomorrow, if not Wednesday. It's gonna take the uh, the time slot of uh, Infested Planet. Um, 
Oh, one more thing. Uh, Easter's coming up, and I don't know what my recording schedule is going to look like because I'm going out to see family. So it might be some episodes might be missed, maybe not. I'm not too sure. Uh, I normally try to have everything uh, recorded way beforehand. Um, but with two full days gone, we don't, I don't know, I don't know. But I do have some emergency pixel piracy footage <laughs> for for just the occasion and looking at uh uh what you guys watch you guys seem to enjoy the pixel piracy quite a bit so <laughs> well i hope so i hope so i hope you guys aren't just thumbing up for my uh, self-esteem or whatnot <laughs> okay guys well i'm going to stop talking now um but uh of course i'm not i'm still talking right now okay yes <laughs> okay so yeah well thank you guys for watching and uh yeah i'll uh i'll talk to you guys next time <laughs> Bye bye